if Matt's head is like by my waist and I try to get the underhook, it's a useless tool for me. I cannot be here. I need my head to be about the center of Matt's chest. And the key is moving Matt or Frankie or whoever's on top of you is problematic. But a lot of times moving yourself is not. So I want to move myself. To help, I will take my bottom leg and instead of inserting it as a guard, I'm just going to bump it against his leg and I bump. As I get my hook, I come up on my forearm, come up on my palm, and then here, maybe I shuck to take his back, maybe I push into it and knee tap, or I usually just jump to the other side and take this position. But the keys to getting up is I have to go from here, I get the underhook, I bump to move my head to his chest level. Now the underhook is a good tool for me. I need to come up on my forearm. If I try to come up here, especially with any kind of weight, it's problematic. So I come here. And the difference is I'm reaching and pulling myself, like I'm pulling my elbow to me. I get to my forearm, get to my palm, and I reach. Almost like um, professional wrestling, you know, like Ric Flair, Hulk Hogan. You know how like there'll be tag team wrestling and um, you know like the dude's in trouble and like Trey is standing outside the, the ring and you know I'm reaching. <laughs> tag, let me tag you in brother, let me tag you in. Cause that dude's just dropping elbows, body slamming me. I'm trying to get tagged in. So Hicks and Gracie calls it invisible jujitsu. Because the thing is, what feels right is to go here reach under and grab Matt. Grab me by the lap. And that always feels right, except it's wrong. Because what happens is Matt drives into me and I'm literally pulling him on top of me. So that sucks. So I wanna be here and I'm reaching here. Like I'll put my palm towards the ceiling. Now when Matt drives into me, there's some resistance. I get to the palm and I come around. So. It's gonna feel right to grab it. It's gonna, it's almost like when you're arm barring somebody in closed door. It just feels right to cross your ankles. Until so they start stacking you on your spine, and you're like, oh, this is a problem. Same thing here. It feels right to just grab him. And I guess if I wanted to, well, I don't guess, if I wanted to scoop under him for like a sweep, then that could be good because I'm gonna pull him and go under it. But if I'm trying to come out the back, I need to reach and keep that pressure so he's not able to smash me. If I grab him, which will feel more secure until he drives into me and now I've pulled him on top of me and I'm being smashed. So don't do that. So I start here. When I go to get the underhook, it's just, I'm taking it from across his um, chest and I'm just driving it under here. Don't try to like, you know, like, I don't know, bench press them up and go under. Like, that's that's not going to work. I mean, maybe against somebody small, maybe. But, you know, not against somebody bigger and stronger than you. Bench pressing them up and trying to go under, that's not going to work. So all I'm doing is I'm relieving the pressure from pushing against this um, collarbone area to just here. And then I get here. And, like, once you get here, you got options. You know, you can bump them, take the back. You could... um. Push in, knee tap, and knock them over. Um, I just like to go over here. That's just what I do. But whatever your game is, that's cool. But you got options there. So the temptation, like I said, is going to be to grab them, and you're just going to be wrong. And you will get smashed for that effort. So I'm here, keeping from head control. I use this. Boom. And I come out here, and I get there, and then from this fighting position, we could do a knee tap. I could sweep under if I wanted. I could bump, shove them over to take their back, or I just jump to the other side, and I got their back. Any of those three or four options could be the right answer. All right.
Let's try getting this under. Remember, I need my head to be chest level. If my head is over here while he's on top of me and I get my underhook, I'm just getting smashed. And you'd be like, man, that underhook don't work. Every time I do it, I get smashed. It's like, yeah. If it's, the technique's not working for you, try doing it the way I showed it. Get <laughs> <laughs> I 